main challenge the European Union is facing is the loss of uh, confidence of uh, the citizens of the member states because if you remember the Lisbon strategy the promise was more and better jobs the result is less and worse jobs and high unemployment frankly said when there existed the Berlin Wall behind the wall was the enemy and the unions and the socialist and Christian governments built what we say what is called the European social model after the fall of the Berlin Wall the enemy suddenly appeared among us and steps were taken to dismantle the European social model. The loss of confidence is clearly visible in the attitude of the trade unions which simply do not believe in the future of the social model. By the way, the unions are seen as the last obstacle to install the, the rule of the invisible hand of the market under the slogan competitiveness. If this is going to be changed, the Commission must act in a different way, the Council, and of course, as a social democrat, I would like to have the majority in the European Parliament. If this does not happen, the loss of confidence will not disappear. To change the root of uh, the European Union, to start approving laws which will create a positive atmosphere in Europe to start fighting against those neoliberals who think that low taxes, weak unions will make Europe competitive. This simply is not true. If you look at the Nordic states they have high taxes, strong unions, great redistribution, and they are all competitive. So, for the future it is necessary that the European Union will copy the good examples existing in some of the member states. I spoke about the Nordic states, but I can mention also Austria, and not invent new and, I would say, even stupid slogans which do not have any results. position as an old trade unionist is to do my best to convince the trade unionists that it is worth going to the elections. They must come to the elections. They must not react as they reacted in the last election, ignoring the elections, not giving the vote to the socialist or social democratic uh, candidates because if they stay at home the result will be the European Parliament full of populists who will not offer any solution. In my country, the perception of the European Union is, frankly said, a tragedy. We had a, an Euro-skeptic president, Klaus, who, sitting on the Prague Castle, bombarded every day the European Union with stupid criticism. And the influence of the president in our country is very strong. And so, now, only about 30% of Czechs believe in uh, uh, 
the European Union as a useful project. This must be changed. Even the right-wing governments we have in the last uh, seven years did not well with the European Union. We play the role of a, not of a useful idiot, but of an unuseful idiot, complaining about everything, criticizing everything. And the press also plays a very bad role, informing only about the troubles the European Union is facing, never informing of the positive steps the Union has done. Uh, this can change under the new government, which is created by free coalition parties, which, which are pro-European. And we have now a new president who is also pro-European. And I believe that uh, this could change the attitude of the Czechs. But of course, the main trouble will be the participation in the elections, because usually it's very low. We hope to have a good campaign and to persuade people that it is good to go to the European elections. Until now, the European Union was a good player on the international scene. The problem is that when the crisis came from the United States, egoism erupted in many member states of the European Union. And uh, the impetus the European Union had, the good name, was attractive for all the regions has been lost and the European Union must act in a very professional way to change this tide. The problem also is that in the European Union usually when something was adopted, rules, and somebody violated the rules, nothing happened. So the so-called political correctness sometimes is an obstacle. We should be more open, more fair, and uh, those who are members of the club and uh, violate the rules must be criticized and steps must be taken to avert in the future a similar behavior.